Now, forewarn weather with cutting edge technology for the most up to the minute forecast in Southeast Michigan. I was bebopping around today doing some errands. It was nice. I'm still Compared basking yesterday. in the glow of what we had last oh, week. Isn't it nice? For, for Thanksgiving, we've never had a oh. better day, I don't think, for the parade. It was I, so, so great. It was fun. So everything else now, we're fine. Oh, good, <laughs> really? Deal with, I, I'm fine. We got past <laughs> Thursday, so writing? we're good. Maybe not. <laughs> I'm not. Honestly, unless I was a meteorologist and came in and looked at the computer models, I would not have known what it was like today because I was like this. <laughs> Checking everything. A little Cyber Monday. <laughs> a little yes. Cyber Monday. Yes. Yeah, I think I got a little, little carpal tunnel. Yeah, <laughs> it might be hard to work the clicker tonight because I've been on it so much. You are our follow-up story then at 6, I think. All right, carpal tunnel and Cyber Monday. All right, outside right now, if you are headed to the airport, everything is fine. It's nice and quiet. However, I do need to tell you, if you have midweek plans, uh, especially Wednesday, and you're traveling in and out of Metro, just kind of keep up to date on your, uh, your flights because we're expecting winds gusting to 40 miles per hour, which may or may not cause a few problems. That's Wednesday. Tonight you're fine. 41 at Metro, 40 in Howell, 39 in Port Huron. If you're headed to the Red Wings game, I know the game is inside, but if you have to walk uh, a long distance, if you want to pay for parking that's far away like I do, temperatures will be in the 30s and it will be dry tonight. The weather story, rain returns tomorrow night, but most of the rain will come overnight while you're sleeping. So between 1 and about 5 a.m. So you probably won't even notice it. Big blast of cold air coming for Wednesday and then gusty winds for the rest of the week. Let's talk about the winds because that's going to be the big story over the next 48 hours. I expect a wind advisory to be issued for Wednesday, probably sometime tomorrow. Tomorrow morning, it's fine. Winds will be about 15 miles per hour. But as the day goes along, you'll notice those winds really starting to pick up. It'll get our temperature up to 50 degrees, but then we're going to drop quite rapidly. And by Wednesday at noon, temperatures will be dropping. Winds will be picking up. These are the wind gusts expected by noon Wednesday. 36 mile per hour gusts, 38 in Pontiac, 37 mile per hour gusts in Ann Arbor. And then as we look ahead to 10 o'clock at night, 40 mile per hour gusts not out of the question. Temperatures right now are in the upper 30s to the north, low 40s down to the south. High temperatures over the next several days will just kind of be up and down. 50 for Tuesday, 40 Wednesday, only 37 for the high on Thursday. And then Friday, we're back up slightly above normal. Now, we do have a lot of clouds in place. There's a little bit of clearing down to our south here, so we might get a couple areas that clear out here in the next several hours, but clouds will fill back in overnight tonight. Now, when the clouds return, it's going to kind of blanket us because our temperatures will stay for the most part in the mid to upper 30s. Some of the outer lying suburbs may be getting down to freezing, but otherwise a very mild night um, by comparison to the last several nights. 50 degrees for the high tomorrow, but that's the only day really that will be that warm this week. So a dry day tomorrow. Rain arrives overnight Tuesday and into the day on Wednesday. Wednesday's the day of change though because temperature highs are only in the upper 30s and we do have lows in the 20s so it's going to the wind chill will be a factor on wednesday so if you have things you'd like to do outside and you want it to be warm tomorrow is going to be the best day friday not too bad either we'll be in the yep. mid 40s back to 51 saturday but sunday down to 40 so mm, really yeah. roller coaster a wild ride this week yeah, you bet all right thanks ken